Hello all, I am Dr. G. Devaki. In this video, we are going to see about Q values for nuclear reactions. So, Q values are going So, let's have some discussion. So, now I am going to see a reaction. So, I am going to see a render reactant. In the render reactant combined, I, maybe I get a single product, maybe I will get a double product. Okay, so in the reaction like Kandipa energy release ayerkuno, illa energy absorb ayerkuno. So in the rend condition, yen the or reaction at thalo, namluke naraka kudiyad. Illa ya. So adha naming yena represent ponvo. We will represent as an energy, right? So idhe da nama nuclear reaction la ponro. So or reaction la energy vande release ayerka, illa absorb ayerkan solla kudiyad a yena the Q. Okay, so the Q value is nothing but the amount of energy released or absorbed by that particular nuclear reaction okay okay so example i am taking nitrogen and helium so nitrogen and helium combine and we got oxygen and hydrogen so some amount of energy will be released or absorbed we will see what is happening in this reaction so q value will be q value the negative over positive over irukalam okay it depend upon the nuclear reactions okay so see q is called nuclear reaction energy so q may be negative or positive it depend upon the reaction so as usual if energy absorb aayirukna nama endothermic nu solluvom illaya so that is nothing but endoergic endoergic okay however exothermic abdina that is exoergic adavadhu energy release ayirukku exoergic na energy release ayirukku endoergic na energy absorb ayirukku nu artham okay so in the case la epdin paapom okay let's see in this case okay so q value nama epdi find out panna porom abdina first i will tell you so i am going to add the mass number of these two reactant and i am going to add mass number of these two reactant after that i am going to uh, see the difference between the reactant and product okay so we'll see how to calculate q value okay so mass of the reactant what i have taken is nitrogen right nitrogen order mass number 14.0031 and helium order mass number is 4.0026 so either sum up panna we got 18.057 atomic mass unit okay it is means this is del m r okay so this is nothing but summation of or mass of reactant sum of the mass of reactant okay del mr is nothing but sum of mass of the reactant it is this del mr will be in atomic mass unit okay and coming to the product again the product is oxygen and hydrogen so 16.991 is an mass number for oxygen and 1.0078 is the mass number of hydrogen so the sum of the product is where the unit means this is del m p this is del m r okay so i am summing up the product mass number of the product i am getting this value so this del m and del m r or p will be in atomic mass unit however q will be in the mass unit milli electron volt okay so milli electron atomic mass unit lindha nam enava convert pananu milli electron volt ah nam convert pananu so adha na pinnadi varen so the product oda mass number product oda mass number rendu na ena pandra sum up pandra so i got 18.0069 atomic mass unit okay so the change in mass number see here in this particular reaction what is happening is equivalent of energy is released okay equivalent of energy is absorbed so 
the value is very low 0.0012 atomic mass unit so na idu enna nu convert panna pora i am going to convert this to million electron volt in order to get the q value so one atomic mass unit equal to 931.5 million electron volt so one million electron volt ku one atomic mass unit is equal to 931.5 million electron volt na so 0.0012 atomic mass unit oda idu evlo irukum appadina just multiply this into 931.5 million electron volt so we got the answer is 1.118 here q is positive in this case because here equivalent amount of energy is absorbed however the main case you have to know is how to identify the q value is c del m r del m product okay if the reactant is less than product appadina and r is greater than product del m p so less than product na how we are going to do is reactant minus c we can say it as del m r minus del m p if i do like this i get minus q value because here the reactant total mass of reactant is less compared to total mass of product endoergic reaction porta varaikum endha oru reaction neenga eduthukitalum product oda total mass total mass of the product will be higher compared to total mass of the reactant so na idayum idayum reactant minus product pandra pa definitely the value will be negative so the minus q value appadina this is endoergic reaction endoergic reaction coming to an another one if the total mass of the reactant is greater compared to total mass of the product appadina i already told you exotho exothermic or exergic reaction appadina enna it loses its mass and it forms a product so idanoda energy release aayirukku so if i do del m r minus del m p appadina what will be the what will be the value i got i got positive q value so positive q value na exothermic exo ergic okay okay idu eppadi appadina or cation or electron release panna adu eppadi vandu cation plus ah maarudho adhe mariya da energy release panna na we are getting a q value positive and energy absorb panna we are getting a q value negative so the value q value negative appadina that is an endoergic reaction and q value positive na that is an exoergic reaction have you all got it clearly okay so this is a concept okay so i have told you total mass of the product is more compared to that of the reactant okay so let's see then endoergic reaction so this in the case is different because equivalent amount of energy is absorbed here so here positive we'll see another equation here see the carbon and hydrogen combine we got nitrogen and neutron here see we got what we got is negative value of q so that this is an endoergic reaction coming to exoergic reaction so see here in this two reaction we got positive see sorry here 200 million electron volt 200 write this correction this is 200 million electron volt okay so here we what we got is plus 2.784 okay this is a positive q value so this is an exoergic reaction if q value is positive then that is exoergic reaction if q value is negative then that is endoergic reaction have you all got the point so this is nothing but q value and very simple topic to understand okay thank you all உங்களுக்கு இந்த வீடியோ பிடிச்சிருந்ததுன்னா ப்ளீஸ் லைக் ஷேர் அண்ட் சப்ஸ்கிரைப் டு மை சேனல் தேங்க்யூ ஆல்